introduce to you now an old boy. He's a member of the Grand Ole Opry, a wonderful guy. He and I and Mel Tillis used to run around together all the time. We got into every kind of thing there is. I know you'll enjoy him. Ladies and gentlemen, help me make welcome Johnny Russell. Here he comes. Woo! Yes, thank you. Everybody see me all right? One, one day, me and, me, and, me and Porter and Mel was together. We was eating lunch, and we got to talking about how we got our money to come to Nashville. Porter made his working in the butcher shop, didn't you? I made mine working in the service station, laying under cars, holding them up where they could grease them. <laughs> Porter said, Mel, how'd you make yours? And Mel said, uh, 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 ch ch chelling, uh, ch chelling of the Bibles. And being the observant man that he is, Porter said, doing what? <laughs> uh, I said, in the Bibles. I said, uh, how long did it take you? He said, uh, a day. Porter said, how many did you sell? He said, uh, a uh, Three hundred and uh, uh, eighty uh, seven, <laughs> and I said, "How many?" <laughs> and Mel said, uh, "Tell him, Porter." <laughs> Porter said, "How can you sell that many Bibles that quick?" He said, "I will I walk up." And I had a knock on the, uh, and they come and open the door, and I, 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 I say, uh, I did. I'm a, I'm a Melvin. And I'm a, a selling a Bible. Would you like to buy a, a, a buy one? Or would you prefer I read it to you? 